Hey guys, this is back with another video, and today we are having an interesting product. This is the Pendyball 10,000 mAh power bank. It's not a usual power bank. It's having the Qualcomm Kick Charge 2.0, as you can see here. It's having 10,000 mAh capacity. So in the box, you will be getting the power bank itself with some user manuals and a very neat looking data cable also you will be getting this letter with the power bank saying the effectiveness of the power bank and why the power banks are not very power efficient so do check that page out i will write down all the stuff in the description below box it says the price of around 3000 rupees as you can see but the actual price is around 15 to 1600 on amazon.in and i bought it from there coming on to the power bank itself it's having the metal body here really good looking with the champagne gold color and we have the plastic bottom and tops both so here is the qualcomm kick charge 2.0 output as you can see this is for power in and this is the smart fit out it can give max of 2.4 amp so this port is also very powerful if you are having the non qualcomm quick charge device and this here is the power button and you see the leds there glowing three leds so at the bottom here it says it can give 12 volt at 1.5 ampere max that's the kind of charging you will be getting from a Qualcomm Quick Charge 2.0 charger. So let me connect a Qualcomm Quick Charge device here. So I am having my Moto G4 Plus here. As you can see, the Moto G4 Plus. I have connected the micro USB cable to the Qualcomm Quick Charge 2.0 port. Here you can see. So as this Motorola Moto G4 Plus supports turbo charging 2.0, the kind of power it is getting from turbo charger is the same as the Qualcomm Quick Charge 2.0 charger. So let me clarify this how it works. So it's power on. So when the charger is connected with Motorola G4 Plus uh, turbo charger, it shows that turbo power is connected. And let me verify that. As you can see the turbo power connected and it will be charged at a higher pace. Do keep in mind this button only turns on the power bank and it turns off automatically. So you see here the mobile is charging with turbo charging. It is reading this power bank as a turbo charger. That's why it charges fast. I have already used this power bank now for around 4 days. And this power bank was able to charge my Moto G4 Plus 2 full times and around 20% at the third time. So the power exchange efficiency of this power bank is really high as compared to other power banks you get. And this power bank was able to charge itself also very quickly as at the bottom it says it can take input of up to 2 amps. I charged it with the turbo charger of my Moto G4 Plus and it charged within 5 to 6 hours. That is quite fast charging. So at the price of around 15 to 600 rupees, I highly recommend this power bank. That's all from this review. If you found this review helpful, kindly press that like button, subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos and I will see you in the next one.